body of missing boater Kenneth St. Romain has been found early this morning in False River following the deadly boating crash that killed another late Friday night. News 2's Taylor Rubach has more on the recovery. And the only thing good about that is the family can finally have a closure. After a day long search, the body of Dr. Kenneth St. Romain was recovered early Sunday morning from False River following a deadly boating accident late Friday night. The crash claiming the life of St. Romain and 31 year old Shay Mooton and injuring two others. Several volunteers and law enforcement agencies were out all day Saturday working to find the missing boater when something was spotted on sonar equipment that evening. We actually received a video late yesterday evening, which helped us a little bit more this morning. After viewing the video, crews were back out Sunday morning dragging False River where the crash happened. And one of those guys picked up an image, and they thought that this was the image that we was looking for. So then a bunch of people got together and just started working in that one area. And sure enough, you know. And Both St. Romain and Mooton were in a fishing tournament Friday on False River, and it's still unclear what led to the deadly collision. The two other passengers were treated for minor injuries. For now, both families now able to receive some kind of closure. One day is too much. So thank goodness it's a early recovery. I visited with the family and broke the news to them, and I stayed on the bank with them instead of going in the water. And I, so our prayers go to that family and also the other family that was involved in this accident. In Point Capee Parish, Taylor Rubach, WBRZ News 2. Wildlife and Fisheries is investigating the cause of the crash. Both St. Romain and Mouton are scheduled for an autopsy tomorrow.